I'd like to talk about section um, 10, rule zero, just talking about the scope of grounding and bonding, this section. This, this is one of the general sections of the code. So it is, those are requirements that apply to all installations, unless they're amended with a specific section of the code. Uh, grounding, if you remember, it refers to the provision of a metallic conducting path from a source um, to the ground to a grounding electrode. So grounding is the provision of a metallic conducting path from the source to the grounding electrode, whereas bonding is a provision of a low impedance metallic conductive path between a non-current carrying part with the intention uh, between all those non-current carrying parts with the intention that they will be maintained at the same potential to the ground and to each other. So that's called equipotential. And usually the bonding system are connected to the grounding system. So again, the scope of section 10, which is rule zero scope, deals with grounding and bonding, where grounding is the conducting path to a grounding electrode. Bonding is the connection between all the metallic non-current carrying parts with the intention that they be maintained in the same potential and they are usually connected to ground.